So information in regards to new content coming to Power World is kind of short. I mean, we received a trailer a couple of days back showcasing a new PAL and a raid that's coming in the next content update. But information in regards to what else is coming is kind of short. There's not much else that we know of. I mean, the player base is at an all-time low. I mean, yeah, obviously they expect that. It's a game once you get to the end of it. There's not much else to do besides breeding and getting those perfect powers. Uh, so many, many players are sitting back, playing other games, taking a break, waiting on new content to come. But over on their Discord yesterday, now they dropped what is absolutely an incredible change that they plan on adding with this next content update whenever that will be today we're getting to it all how's it going guys my name is dpj and if you do enjoy this video leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more power world be sure to subscribe okay so we already saw that new trailer of the new power balanor uh, which you'll see on the screen now just running in the background as well as a new well it says new raid we don't know exactly what's going on here. We just literally see like a giant power soul being plugged into like this terminal and then this power spawning with those meteors falling behind her. Uh, but what does this mean? <laughs> this, there's no context here, so we don't know. Uh, we've seen all the meteors behind. Are we spawning into a boss battle here? Does this giant power soul artifact spawn this secret pal which we fight? Is this the raid? I mean, it doesn't quite make sense to me. A raid is a raid. Plugging in this artifact, this power soul, and spawning this, this power to fight isn't exactly a raid in my opinion. It's just a bus. So I don't actually think we've seen footage of what a raid will be as of right now. We're just seeing a new power. And I'm pretty sure over the next week or so, we're going to see more teasers and a few other things. But over on their Discord, they drop something which is absolutely incredible in regards to a new feature that will be coming so over on the discord they actually stated this um let me just go to it a little sneak peek of another feature in the upcoming date i think it means upcoming update when you're not taking on balanor enjoy some relaxing base management and what we see here guys is a new feature at the monitoring stand uh, you can manage the tasks performed by base pals so yes how many times how many times have you basically required a pal to do a certain thing? You put them in your base and it goes and does its own thing. It doesn't do the thing you want it to do. Well, guys, this new feature completely eliminates that. As you're seeing on screen now, it's got 18 pals at his base. You can see all the work suitabilities along the top uh, column there. You can uncheck these. So therefore, if you have a certain pal, let's say you have Grisbolt, Grisbolt obviously has that generating electricity work suit ability, but you can actually uncheck this. You can uncheck his lumbering. You can uncheck his transporting. And you can obviously uncheck that one we're going to talk about at the end there. It looks like a crucible symbol, but obviously it means fighting or base protection if you get raided or whatever. But you can uncheck all of these guys so you prioritize his handiwork. So you only do handiwork. You can do this with Anubis. I absolutely need this on my Anubis. I've bred the perfect Anubises. I've got like 20 of them across my three bases. But a lot of the time, they run straight to that mining site and just start mining. I've got so much stone. I don't know what to do with it. I can uncheck this so they won't be doing that mining no more. And I only concentrate on certain things I want them to do. This is a massive, massive change. It's a great, great change. It's something a lot of us have called for for quite a while. It's good to see. That they're actually uh, taking note of what we want it's absolutely great it's a definite welcome change i just hope i just hope that there is much more to come as well i mean one new pal and a raid boss won't be enough in regards to a major content update to bring players back i just i just know it won't be even a feature like this i just know it absolutely won't there needs to be some deep changes to the game going forward in regards to what breeding can offer and what you can achieve from it and a purpose to continue on to breed we need reason to breed i mean yes pvp sounds like a good reason to me but a lot of players won't be playing pvp what about these players who just want to stick to pve people playing in their own world just doing their own thing there needs to be more on offer for said players too now a lot of this can come with new features they have planned that we see from the road map but I'm not sure that they plan to incorporate this within that next content update. We see we're getting new pals. We've seen one new pal so far. We see it says PvP Palerina. We've got PvP in general. We've got Raid 
boss battles we've got uh new islands which i'm super super excited for but i'm not sure with this next content update what they plan to drop in the game that we'll get all this there's just something tells me at the back of my mind that this isn't happening it's a gut instinct guys i think what they're planning to do is prepare a massive content update and this is the same thing they want players to test they want to test this before it actually drop into the game but for now we'll get a small content update where they introduce this new pal and this raid as well as a few of our features like we've seen here with a monitoring stand i think this is what they'll drop first and then we may get a bigger update later on but hey i do hope i'm wrong this game needs content and it needs it relatively quite quickly i mean there's the game is dropping off faster than i can say phenomenal ultra microscopic silica for gnosis let me tell you this game is dropping off it needs something to revive it it really does we do live in a gaming world now where players do quickly move on yes there's always going to be that player that will come back no matter what but the majority of players i feel unless there's a massive content drop which drastically change the game in game two and gives reason for players to continue on playing um i'm honestly not sure about the future and how it will go i really ain't i sit here and say this now i don't want it to be this way but i'm sitting here thinking about this and i've been thinking about it over the past few or four weeks now that the game fell off so fast it drastically needs new content and it drastically needs foundational changes to keep players playing for a longer time but in pocket pair i have faith the base game is incredible what they've achieved so far is incredible a lot of people have spent money on this game so i do feel that a good majority of them will come back no matter what so yeah hopefully sooner rather than later and hopefully we see new stuff added pretty soon because the game really does need it now let me know your thoughts on this down below within that comment section i mean do you feel the same way i feel do you feel that we will get a small content update first before we see the inclusions of pvp that pvp arena uh, the new islands and this that and the other i think we we probably will i think we'll see a small update in regards to them adding this pal into the game and this first raid boss battle whatever this is to test the waters and then go on to add further more things into the game with a larger content drop which is like i said what they're planning on uh, allowing people to fill out a form and play test that's what i feel what's going to go down here but we will see guys we will see but let me know your thoughts down below guys if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out if you like what you see and want to see more power world be sure to subscribe and hopefully guys i will see you on that next one